Good morning, hello. I have such bad travel sickness, so I don't know why I sound so chirpy because the inside of my stomach is not chirpy at all. You can see present bags behind me. I'm holding my stomach like I'm pregnant, I'm not. So we just got to Dalesford in the Cotswolds. We're hoping we can go in and get a coffee and a snack, but there's a very long queue outside. So we're gonna go and see what the situation is. But basically this weekend we have the most exciting weekend ahead. Obviously we're not going abroad at the moment. Sob, everyone else is. I'm quite jealous, I have FOMO. We organized a staycation for my family as a Christmas present back in 2019. We obviously had to change it in May and it's now August and we are here. So I'm super excited. My family are really excited. We're meeting them later. We've hired the most insane house. This was kindly organised as a press trip for me by Sykes Cottages, a gifted press trip that was organised in 2019. They haven't actually asked me to talk about it or put it anywhere, but of course I am because they vlog my life and there's so much I want to show you. The house is called Cotswold House and I will link it below because Oh my god, from the pictures, it's dreamy. So I've organised so much stuff, like cute little cookies in the rooms for everyone, and I've got bags and bags of stuff to take into the house. But until we can check in, because they're doing really strict cleans and new linen and everything, I'm super impressed. We are going to go and stand in the sunshine and see if we can get a coffee and some food. Here it is. Woo! Wow. Wee! Okay, it is time for the grand tour. We are inside the house. Okay, it's time for the grand tour. We are inside the house, Cotswold House. I'm so excited to see this. Okay, let's do a little tour of the house. So, in this room, if we can find the light. Oh, this is a pool table. Oh, yay! Oh wow, we found the pool table which the boys are going to play on on an evening. This is a really good setup. Din din din. Very excited for a glass of vino and playing on that. Oh my, they've got darts as well. And in here we've got a little lounge area with a log burner which I'm so excited to use. And then in here, oh, hello, skylight. We've got a kitchen, nice big kitchen with an auger. Amazing, lovely and clean. And then in here, we've got a little washroom. Oh, look at this! This is so cute. Wait for it and make ball. Oh my gosh. Ball for mates. And then in here, the wine cellar. Ooh, I see a food hamper. Oh my gosh, I've always wanted to try this chocolate brand. Oh, that's so cute. Yes. He's shouting me, I'm coming. Din, din, din. Oh wow, this is gorgeous. And then we have the most amazing lounge. Let's quickly look at the garden. Oh, gorgeous garden with a gorgeous little seating area. We'll go into the garden soon. Oh, wow, this is divine. Oh, it's been so beautifully finished. Look at this. This is utterly divine. Oh my gosh, look at this sculpture. Wow, let's not let Maple go anywhere near you. Oh wow, how amazing. Gorgeous dining room. Work hard and be nice to people. I love that. Okay, so where are you taking me now on the tour? Up the stairs we go. Let's see what's upstairs. Din, din, din. So we have a shower room, which is gorgeous. We'll just walk in, shower, cow shed, toiletries. I approve. A washroom. 
we have our little washroom, which is fantastic with a steamer and everything in. Where have you gone? You found it. Oh, gorgeous, gorgeous bedroom. So there's this bedroom. This might be the master, actually. Shower, have you so seen this bar? That is a dream. <gasps> Look at the shower. Oh, so incredibly dreamy. Matt's happy about the shower. I'm happy about the bath. I'm also happy about this. How divine. So this is a master bedroom. So we'll be taking this one. So I'm just unpacking and getting everything organized. I love having all my beach products with me organized and out of the bag so I can have a pamper. And I also brought these guys in my bag with me. I'm so excited to tell you guys about them. So they're by Swiss. And actually, I've been thinking about CBD for and actually, I've been thinking about trying CBD for quite some time, but I wanted to make sure that it was a really good brand and Swiss were recommended to me. I've actually heard of them for so many different things. So I was like, oh, they look amazing. So many people have said to me for years, oh, you need to try CBD for this. You need to try CBD for that. And I was like, oh, okay, maybe it's time I give it a go. So this one is the CBD oil and you can get it in different strengths. It's a full spectrum extract it's actually a really handy little one as well perfect to kind of pop in your nighttime bedtime tea i personally just find it nice and it helps me sleep a bit better but it's totally a personal thing you might find it works for you in other ways for other things and the swiss cbd oils contain a patented full spectrum cbd extract from europe you can get them in three strengths 100 mg 200 mg or 500 mg the idea is that you literally place a recommended number of drops under your tongue varies depending on the strength and you hold for 30 to 60 seconds and then swallow but it does tell you directions on there and like i say i like to pop two little drops in my nighttime bedtime tea swiss has been a pioneer in wellness for over 50 years so i have used many of their products before which is why i kind of wanted to try these ones and use these ones also what's important is these are independently tested for quality and purity so i like that if you're wondering what these little ones are little capsules the CBD immunity maintains healthy immune systems with vitamin C, D3 and elderberry. I really like vitamin capsules and these ones obviously have the extra CBD. So yeah, you've got a quality CBD extract with a nice natural flavour as well. And then you've got these which have all of the vitamins that I mentioned but they also contain 5 mg of full spectrum CBD oil. There are so many things you can use them for. I've heard these are amazing actually after a workout. So I can't wait to keep trying them. So far, so good. Sorry, family. This is our room. I love that mirror as well. Perfect. Where are you going now? Where are you? This one. Gorgeous bed. Oh, how lovely is that bed? It's got old football seats in. Oh, that's so cool. How cool is that? And then another gorgeous bedroom here. I think Adam's going to want this one. I want to say it's a five bed house, I think. Oh, it's a nice little feature. <laughs> this is so cool. Look at this. Oh. So now we're upstairs. Oh, this is gorgeous. Another room. How stunning. Literally beautiful. Wow, the artwork in here is just out of this world. So much effort has gone into the beautiful design. Next. Oh, gorgeous shower. Yeah, this did have a roll top bath and they renovated it and did it as a gorgeous little shower. That is delightful. Next. <laughs> Oh, how gorgeous. Oh, so lovely. This is like a fun room. Yeah, look. Oh, Matt's so happy because there's oh, a game we'll take, room. We'll take this room. And Matt wants this room so he can play with all the toys. This is like a games room. Also this, so we can go out here when we figure out how to get out there. I brought loads of drinks from home. And I also brought bags of goodies for the ladies. And then Matt set all of this out for me, bless him. Okay, so these are very special and I actually got them made by a girl who follows me and I just thought, oh my gosh, I'm going to pay you to get these made because they are so special. Mabel can't eat them, but I thought it would be nice to get hers anyway. Then I went to Dominique Ansel and I bought some sourdough for everyone and some Harvey Nichols jam. So everyone, 
has got lots of stuff to be nibbling on. Okay, so I just sorted my makeup out. Sorted myself out because we've been wearing masks earlier. So I just sorted my makeup out. And now I'm just showing you the outside of Cotswold House, which is absolutely divine. I feel like we should stay here for a week so we can have barbecues and picnics. Look at this place. It's utterly divine. I am in love. Oh, I'm so organized now. You can hear Matt playing. This is my dress and I've just popped my little slippers on because they said in the guidelines, they were like, you can bring your own slippers if you want. So I was like, yes, I'm bringing these. So we're literally just waiting for the family to arrive and I have organized a very special grazing dinner indeed. I found a local lady in the Cotswolds who does grazing platters and I was just gonna do it myself, but I was like, no, I wanna pay someone local, give them the business and help them. So we have her coming and setting up a dinner for everyone, a grazing platter. That is already all sorted. Playing pool or snooker, whichever one it may be. Snooker. Yeah, my girl's here. She loves the grass. You love the grass. <laughs> she loves it. Have you ever seen her run so fast? Where you Oh my gosh, she's so happy. She's so happy that the family have arrived. Look how happy she is. She was destined to live in the Cotswolds. She's a country girl. Oh, Where you oh she loves it. So happy! <laughs> so happy in the garden! Ah! You are so happy, Mapes, aren't you? Look how happy she is. We're just chilling. You got a new house. You got a new house. <laughs> Okay, so Jess, the lady who has just come and put our spread out, has just finished. Ah, let's show you. How amazing does this look? What a spread. That is insane. How good is that? She has a seriously good spread. Taking maple on a cup swords walk. like a princess in the garden doing a little workout <sighs> I'm running around after maple and then we paid for the lady Jess who came yesterday to do our amazing dinner spread to come and do breakfast so I'm gonna eat after <sighs> let's go Cranberry, isn't it? Is it bacon, bacon and cranberry? cranberry? Yum! Mommy! I don't like bread. Mommy! Like Mommy! Yeah. Mommy! showered I'm ready so we've packed up some although there wasn't much left because we have a big family some of the dinner from last night the spread and then a little bit of the breakfast spread which was divine but to be honest we ate most of it this is like the alcohol se session the alcohol boss that I brought we're getting through it like last night I was like oh my god most of the wine's gone um I've got this little dress on and because it's actually not that warm I've been able to put my knee high beats so on so we are going to explore some local areas today and then come back and enjoy a stunning, stunning house. This is today's outfit. I literally love this dress. It's so nice with the bag that I take everywhere. I love this little area. It's so cute. So Matt and I, we walk around and we see other people's dogs, don't we? Yeah. And we're like, oh my god! And now people keep walking past our dog and saying, oh my god! 
cutie, she's a cutie pie. We just had a little picnic off the food from yesterday for our lunch. So good, but it's a little bit windy. Maple is tired, she's sleepy. Take her back to the housey. I had a nap, such a long nap, because it was so comfy, the bed, and I really needed one. But we have spent the afternoon eating chocolates, catching up, nibbling, eating the food from last night. Actually, we're kind of almost out of it now. Those pakoras are so good. Now I'm changed, and we are heading for dinner. Super, super excited. Mabel's first ever pub experience. Heading to a pub that Will and Kay love, as in the royal family. Matt took me here for my birthday, so it's really special to us. And it's also the first pub where we ever met a golden doodle. So this is where the idea of Maple was born. So I've got my knee highs on. Oh, <laughs> and I've got this dress on. Let's go. Can't wait. Here's the dress. I love it. What are the boys doing? Here they are. Loving it. <laughs> Oh, beautiful. Can we film it up? Can we I got that. Can we get a little bit of a little bit of a you can use mine. <laughs> You're such a good girl, you haven't a yawn. I did an amazing workout, just a little 30 minute one in the garden, snuggled maple, had a breakfast spread, and any food we haven't been eating we've been having for lunch, but we've managed to get through it. The most amazing spread again from the lovely local business of Wild and Brie. I just put a face mask on, this one, which was kind of gifted to me. I'm in a partnership with Neutrina, but this isn't paid for. Um, amazing, amazing mask. Matt, did you love it? I just showed Matt my skin. I was like, how's my skin look? He was like, it looks like a baby's bum. And I was like, thanks. And um, this is our instant cream mask. It's £3.50. I'm going to link it below because it is so handy for travel and I've really missed using these little travel pots. You could definitely get two use of uh, one pot. I just put loads on and I used one and Matt used one, but really, really good. So I'm going to get ready now. Gorgeous sunny day outside. My family have gone out to explore. We're actually visiting some friends this afternoon. Super excited, so we're gonna enjoy the house this morning. It's too beautiful not to just soak this up. Hello, it's been a busy afternoon of getting lots of work done in this gorgeous house. I wish this was my office all the time. Now we're heading for dinner. We're heading to a place called the Kingham Plough. Sorry, you can hear my retainers. I sound a bit weird. Oh, we actually visited some friends today as well. Safe, social distanced, of course. And I didn't film because, oh my God, the house is just insane. You'll see it one day, I'm sure. Um, now we are going to dinner at somewhere that David Beckham apparently loves, the Kingham Plough, so let's go. Home in my dress. 
dressing gown with our dog and just put out some wine, cheese and chockies. Oh, we're so at home here, we never want to leave. It's a rainy morning in the gorgeous house, but it's still so lovely. Oh, yes. We are just getting ready to go to Vista Village today. We have to say goodbye to this house because of COVID and everything. We have to check out at 10 a.m. So we're up bright and early and getting out and saying goodbye to the dream princess bed. Make sure you're following my home account at Mshell Home so you can see Instagram from my house. So I've got so much from this house and I'll link this house below because you guys need to book it, like our whole family wants to book this for Christmas, but sadly they're booked up, so hopefully we'll come back in low season. It's just been amazing. Sorry about my voice, again, my retainer. So we are gonna head to Bista Village now. I'm doing a full vlog at Bista Village, but I will show you on this vlog as well, because I know people get excited. I am back in London now ready to move so make sure you keep an eye on the moving vlogs I've actually got my new Pradas on I don't really want to show you because my feet are gammy I need to scrub and I need to sort my nails out but I will do a full Vista Village vlog I don't know what's first this one or my Vista Village vlog I'm thinking my this vlog will probably be first and then I did a full video all about Vista Village so to conclude for this vlog so to conclude for this vlog the weather was like very hit and miss at Vista today so we had like a lot of rain a lot of sunshine then the craziest wind so it was quite difficult but I did treat myself to a Prada bag some Prada shoes the Prada was insane like literally insane and the Christian Dior was the best I've ever seen Dior they had a really safe queuing system in place in Bista. It felt amazing. Also I've worked with Bista but like three years ago so I just went as a customer. Had so much good food. Did our shopping actually the quickest we've ever done it today mainly because they have the queuing system in place where you literally just put your name down and you do like virtual queuing and you book. It just means it's safer and it's social distanced and we more wore our mask the whole time when we were in shops but as it's open air shopping you don't have to wear it when you're walking outside any questions just leave them below but there will be a whole vlog as well about Vista also I just love my dress I just felt that Prada was just out of this world so we just got a Greek takeout on the way I honestly had the best time ever at Cotswold House I'm so sad that we're back like if it was up to me I would just book it out for two weeks at a time in that roll top bath and feel the rain on the windows oh my god it was just a dream and my whole family loved it I feel very relaxed and I will see you guys soon for some more exciting vlogs. Come say hi on Instagram at mshellax and mshellhoes.